When you first walk in, you see a whole wall of multi-planed material and all of these holes, and it, ha it connotes something somewhat of a peep show kind of effect, and that's something that you would expect normally from anything that has to do with lingerie or intimacy or sexuality. And so we kind of flipped it on its head and made it more like viewfinders. I mean, our idea was kind of like, what if we just divide the space in half, like literally cut it in half? You piece together a collage of an idea of what you think the inside space is, which is hopefully radically different when you finally walk in. It's kind of like a giant apparatus in the sense that the lights are, are pointing through. So as people walk through this, this part and as they look in, it blocks the light on the inside. So if you're inside, it's changing. So it's very much about this idea of like an experience rather than an object or some you know, formal thing that you see and then you just know what it is. We actually created all of these designs and all of these fabrications specifically for this pop-up store. We had these hand-painted by our friend Francesca Dimitio. So we actually partnered with Nike on doing a limited edition Air Force One. The green is supposed to kind of allude to having felt like under a sculpture or under a pot that goes on something precious. Another thing that has been really popular for us in the past is hosiery that has no bottom. And a lot of what we're playing with is is packaging that makes it a bit more friendly. So if you're looking for something that's maybe a little bit more risque, you feel more comfortable buying it from us because it's tongue in cheek and it's friendly and funny. We sell out every time we do yeah. them, even when girls Get to the point. <laughs> <laughs> they girls like it. <laughs> we also made magnets of some of our favorite images. This is our little candle section. We thought this would be funny. They actually are blessed <laughs> by um, voodoo priestesses in California, and they all have an actual um, spell on the back of them. We have more voodoo candles. We have male, female, and embracing. So it's kind of a play on the idea of ritual and romance and fetishism and all of these things combined. We like to kind of link all these ideas to how you view lingerie and how you view sexuality. But also with such a sense of humor, it's supposed to be funny.